Hello, Sterile Processing Universe, and welcome to another episode of Real Talk. Today, I would like to cover a topic that we all know exists. It's in every one of our facilities. We talk about it all the time, but we really don't know what to do about it. What is that, you ask? It is the issue of overloaded instrument sets. I pause just a minute because you all know what I'm talking about. We see it in every facility, every facility that we have worked at. We know it is happening. We know it's out there and we know that our sets are, are not only overloaded, but grossly overloaded. So today I want to talk about a couple of things. I'd like to talk about the implications of an overloaded instrument set. When you have overloaded instrument sets, they are going through your system from the time they leave the operating room, go to decontamination, to inspection assembly, to uh, sterilization, to storage and back to the operating room, and even in the operating room, setting up and breaking down the back table. There are issues throughout this entire process. One of the first issues is in sterile processing. You're reprocessing many instruments that don't need to be reprocessed. If you have a set of 100 instruments, you can safely say that 50 of those instruments can come out of the sets. If you have any doubt in what I'm saying, post a person in your decontamination area for five days, and their job is to only take pictures of your sets as they come back to decontamination from the operating room. You're going to take a picture based on what has been used and what is unused in that set. And I can assure you the results will be astonishing, astounding, enlightening. Uh, pick any word you want. But you will be overwhelmed by the amount of instruments that you do not use on a daily basis in your operating rooms. So the issue is when they come to decontamination that both unused and the used or dirty instruments have to be cleaned and go through the entire process all over again. So think about the time savings just in decontamination with manual cleaning if you were to take a set from 100 to 50 instruments. It's pretty astonishing when you think about the time. Think about getting them through the washer and how more effectively they will be cleaned in your washer disinfectors with 50 fewer instruments in your trays. Now, if you move over to the inspection assembly area, think of the time savings of inspecting 50 instruments as opposed to 100. Now the tray is assembled, it goes into the autoclave, it comes out, you put it in storage, you send it back to the operating room. Think about the time that the OR technician saves setting that instrument set up on the back table. 50 instruments as opposed to 100. Likewise, when they break it down. Again, I think the results are gonna astound you. And remember, we're talking about an OR minute that can have an average price of $150 per minute. So what if you save five minutes setting up? Pretty amazing to think about. Okay, now another huge issue is repairs. All of those instruments, when you have your set refurbished or going out to the repair van, and they need to be repaired, refurbished, so the vendor is taking care of all 100 instruments. Now, a lot of those instruments are not getting used, but they're getting refurbished. So think about cutting that set down to 50 instruments from 100 and the cost savings that you will see in your sterile processing budget, your OR budget. It is really amazing. There are all kind of fancy words out there for reducing the number of instruments in your sets. Uh, optimization is the first one that comes to mind. It's a big word, it sounds great, but at the end of the day, it's all about reducing the inventory in your sets. Once those instruments have been taken out of the sets, think about the cost avoidance that you can occur in your department. You can take those sets to build other sets. 
you can replenish your back stock so you have sets to pull in case a set comes down that's missing instruments. There are so many great advantages to optimizing your instrument sets. And I'm saying 50% when I say cut from 100 to 50, but there are people out there, including Dr. Peter Nickel, our CMO. He says that you can cut 75 instruments out of 100 out of a set. This is coming from a surgeon. I think that's pretty profound. So as you go through your week, as you're thinking about another project in your department, think about this optimization project. After you've taken the pictures and you've gathered the data to show that you do in fact have overloaded sets, put a team together of clinicians, scrub technicians, nurses, physicians, sterile processing, infection control, and look for ways that you can break your sets down and remove instruments from those sets. It's going to be better for everyone, the, the sterile processing department, the OR department, the patient that's coming into the operating room. It will benefit everyone. I hope you've enjoyed this episode of Real Talk. This is Bob Mars. Have a fantastic day. Healthmark has intelligent cleaning solutions for your cleaning verification program, including products to measure water temperature, water quality, cleaning efficiency, and directly test for residual soil left on instruments. Find out more about products like the Cart Wash Check that tests for mechanical efficiency and target temperature. The HemoCheck that can detect beyond what the eye can see. Find your tools for cleaning verification at hmark.com. There you will learn about our TOSI and SonoCheck that test the performance of mechanical washers as recommended in sterilization standards guidelines. Also, check out performanceqa.com. It's a secure online database that allows you to record statistics for the performance of your decontamination procedures, including test results from Healthmark's performance line of monitoring products. With this cloud-based database, you can record data, generate reports, and track the performance of your cleaning equipment over time. Through our strategic partnerships, Beyond Clean is now providing seasoned interim OR and sterile processing management and experienced frontline sterile processing technician staffing. Whether you need to fill a gap from an unexpected retirement or get your department through a season of increased surgical volume, our interim staff are certified with a minimum of two years experience and can join your team in as little as one to two weeks. For more information on how Beyond Clean can provide these much needed resources in your department's time of need, contact info at beyondclean.net.